Here it is, Earth with rings. Today, we've got a completely modded solar system on Space Engine. So Earth now has rings and every single rocky planet has been terraformed. Today, what we're gonna do, we're gonna go through and check out what the solar system could look like if they were all terraformed. So, so this simulation takes place in the year 2518. So maybe in 500 years from now, they will have figured out how to put rings on Earth. Okay, but these are a real model of rings like similar to Saturn's rings, we can actually go in them and they're made of little particles. Oh, if we can get in there. See, they are they are real particles. Okay, so let's go look and see what rings could look like from the surface. So this is like Africa. Let's go, should we go in the ring shadow or not yet? Let's go like right here. So this is like the Sahara Desert. We're just in the desert. Look at that. Okay, that is the view of what rings could look like on Earth. Let's go somewhere where it's like, looks more like Earth. Up north, maybe? Where we're more in like green area. I want like a hill. Oh yeah, go in these mountains. Yeah, okay, then where are the rings? Look at that, that is so cool. Okay, this is like realistic lighting. So if you're in the middle of the day, you wouldn't actually see them that much. You can barely see them there. But as it gets to night, let's like fast forward time and wait for night. Look at that, because the reflection, you wouldn't be able to see the stars as easily because of the light pollution from the rings, because the rings would be so bright. But that is cool. And then once the shadow of the planet actually takes over, more would appear. That's cool. Okay, so that is Earth with rings. Check this out. All the links to the mods I'm using today will be in the description below if you want to get them on Space Engine. Also, the moon is terraformed now. So let's go take a look at the moon. Check this out. So this is a terraformed moon. So they took a model, the model that Space Engine does use for the moon and terraformed it. So check it out. It's like all the craters are filled with water and it has an atmosphere now. Like this looks like Earth, but you can see Earth with rings up there in the sky. That is cool actually. It looks like it's like almost red. Let's get rid of, yeah. So this is like the actual surface of it. If you get rid of the water too, that looks just like the moon except colored. Let's go on the night side with everything on and see what, I wanna see what earth would look like. Oh, wait, there's city lights. So there's like actual cities on here. I mean, yeah, they are like glowing, but yeah. Side, look at that, that is so beautiful. So wait, I wanted to look. Oh, and also in this mod, they've added the moon. The moon has its own moon now, it's called a moonlit. This is the moon's moon. It's very dark, let's, okay. It looks like a little UFO almost. It's like bulging around the equator of it. But let's land on this and get a view of the moon, which is its main parent. That's the view of the moon from the moonlit. And then we can see the view of the earth right here. Check that out. That is so cool, okay. We're gonna go to Mercury and Venus. They are together actually. So what they've done is they've made it so Mercury is now a moon of Venus. So you can see this is Venus right here. It is pretty similar to Earth. Oh, I didn't mean to land on it yet. Pretty similar to Earth. And then they've added Mercury as a moon of it. So it's not so close to the star that it burns up. So let's start with Mercury here. This is insane. If you turn off everything, does it still look like Mercury? Yeah, kind of. You get like the craters and everything still. You could see that it was Mercury and then they've added a little bit of city light. Whoa, okay, let's go down let's turn the water back on they've added like full-on oceans atmosphere and everything like this looks just like earth that is so cool let's see okay the view of venus from mercury that's got to be cool okay so even during the day let's turn off clouds so this is mercury during the day you look up and that is venus okay this is a realistic lighting so it would be very bright because you have the sun there but still look at that you get this glowing ring and then if we wait for it to be night Maybe we can get an even better view of it. Okay, so it's on the other side. Okay, so nighttime on Mercury. So it's like sunset time. You look up, where did it go? <gasps> oh, that's the reflection of, okay. So this is actually during the nighttime on Mercury, it looks so bright because of the reflection from Merc or from Venus. So you know how like at night on Earth, the moon will light up the sky and you can kind of see a little bit. It's so extreme on Mercury that it looks like day still because of how bright Venus is. That is cool. Okay, let's go check out Venus. You can see how, so this is the sunlight and then this is the Venus light. Interesting. And then you do have a true night if neither of them are showing on you. But let's go over to Venus. This is a view of Venus. It's so cool. Okay, and you can see that it says temperate marine terra with life. So they've all been altered too. And it even has like all of the structures too. Like look at this landscape that you get. This looks just like Earth. Okay, I'm interested to see what Mercury would, okay, so there's Mercury. 
So during the day, this is like almost sunset. That is the view of Mercury. It is so big. It's a lot bigger than the relationship between the moon and the Earth. So I'm sure it's going to have a similar effect where Venus gets lit up by Mercury too a little bit. Maybe not as extreme. So this is night. I think the atmosphere is still super thick and that's why we get... That's why it's so yellow even at night because it's like reflecting and trapping the light. There's the view of Mercury from Venus. Okay, and then let's look at Venus. Like, look, it like lights up even at night all the way around. Interesting. Okay, so there's Venus. There's Mercury. Now we're going to go to Mars. Whoa, okay. This one is actually the one I'm most excited for because it still has all the features that Mars has. So, it, for example, take away some of this. You can see this is Valles Marineras right here if you drain the ocean. And then like Olympus Mons is right here. So let's go look at, oh, let's go look at Valles Marineras first. So this canyon right here is the biggest canyon in the solar system. But in this version of Mars, they filled it with water instead. So this is it drained. This is what it looks like. It's almost blue still because it's like sea rocks. But if you add the water back, you'll see that it fills with water. That's cool. Okay, we do have an atmosphere on here and it's thick. Looks like this. This looks like Earth, but the this river here or whatever it is. Yeah, it would be like a giant river would be so much bigger than any of the ones on Earth. It looks like we still have a lot of drier areas, which is probably realistic. Like down here still looks pretty close to Mars, except we're lacking that red atmosphere. And then right here, this is the tallest mountain in the solar system. Check it out. It even like reaches all the way into space. Like the atmosphere is way thinner up here than it is down here. And we even get like the tropical area. I love this so much. It's so cool. Check that out. Okay. And then we do have Phobos and Deimos still, which are the same. These aren't terraform, but I wanted to see if I land on it and then look at Mars. Look at that. Whoa. Okay. That's a cool picture right there. We're taking a picture. Okay, so it looks like some of Jupiter's moons have life too. Io, Europa, and Callisto all are green now. I wonder if there's any real difference on them though. It looks about the same. Io is pretty cool, but I don't see a difference. Let's go to Europa and see. Yeah, they look about the same. So I think maybe um, it's just showing that humans have colonized at this point. So like there are humans on here but they haven't done a lot of terraforming, obviously. Oh, there's some clouds on here. Those probably weren't there before. Maybe they were. So maybe a little bit. Is there like cities on the back? No, I don't see any. Okay, well that is the terraformed solar system. If you guys have more mod suggestions or you want similar videos to this, leave a like on the video so I know. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.